guys, welcome back. Today's video is on the position of attention. I don't think people completely understand how to do and how to stand the position of attention, so I really want to cover it. Um, mainly your arms and hands, your feet, mainly the whole position. What do I say? Let's get started. Okay, so first things first is you want to look at the regulations. Now, every position stems from the position of attention, so you really want to make sure that you're teaching this one right. So, let's get looking into Ahmed. Okay, so the first thing what you want to do when you don't know if you're doing the position right, or because, like I said, I don't think a lot of you are doing it right, is you want to look up the regs. So this is Afman 36-2203, chapter 3, it's page 18, and it says very clearly right here, to come to attention, bring heels together smartly and on the line, place the heels near to each other in conformation with body permits and ensure feet, blah, 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 blah. It's a whole paragraph about standing. If you look down here, a pretty nice, well laid out picture of exactly what it needs you to look like. Let's look at this a little bit more. Here we have a side view of what someone would normally look like. You can see a little bit of fidgeting, arms not really where they should be, and then just not really right. And the body placement is like you would see on a normal cadet. Kind of to the side, with the right idea, just not right. Once again, what you would typically see with the right idea, but not correctly right. The face, looking straight ahead, mm, I see more problems with the shoulder placement. So, okay, what you're gonna wanna see is your shoulders up, back, down. Okay, stay normal. Shoulders up, shoulders back, down. Up, back, down. So you can see those kind of three movements and that's the position you're gonna be standing at. Okay, moving on to the hands. Okay, see the seam on the side? That's gonna be where you want your hands together. So you can take your hand like this. You curl it up, you put your thumb down. So your hands are completely like curled this. in like this. Yeah. So it's like this, okay? Then the seam of your pants is where you want this little divot between your thumb and your fingers to be. It goes right on there. And right there, like that? Right there, like that. So you don't, you want your wrist straight down, but you also want your thumb pointing towards the ground. He's holding his hand right, it's just this needs to be pinned against the side. So there shouldn't be any extra room. And another thing to notice is you don't want shadows. You don't want this extra, you want your arm against your body like he has right there. 45 degree angle together. Um, one measure that you can check is it's about another foot right in here especially when you're wearing boots. So here you have your feet at a 45 degree angle. But this is not a comfortable position. It's kind of mirrored as to what your body would normally stand like, but standing at it for more than five minutes is gonna be uncomfortable. And I don't think that the people have that inherent understanding of it's a position for parades. It's a position at which everything is done. Every position, you're gonna be stemming from that position of attention, which is why I think it's such an important position to teach and understand well. Um, the shoulder thing, I think is such an inherent thing because your shoulders want to go down like this and you just kind of want to slouch. But when you go up, back, down, your posture, you can just see my forehead just went on a front, like I just grew from sitting like this. And I think that most people would just sit at attention like this. So if you always remind your kids, up, back, down, and that's how you should march it. Your arms, you need to lock the elbow. I mean, read it, understand it, and know what the position of attention is really like. And really know what you're going for and what you want from your cadets. Thanks guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and you learned about the position of attention. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And thank you to my little brother, Hudson, who helped and was my dummy. Per se. <laughs> I'll see you next video. Bye guys. Are getting ABUs. The goal of this was because we're part of Total Force.